Hello everybody, this is Deidre with Paper Crafts and Planners, and I am going to do a review and comparison of two productivity planners that are on the market right now. One is the Wind Planner and one is the Panda Planner. And I will link below to a really in-depth walkthrough I did of this planner. And I've done walkthroughs of the Panda Planner before, um, and because I've done a giveaway with it in previous years. So, but I'm gonna show you how these two, first of all, this one, the wind planner comes in this little magnet closure box. It has a place for your goals here and a place for a sort of a vision board or a picture of your why. Um, for, and you can keep it in that box in between using it if you want to. This one has an elastic band closure, okay? This one has two ribbon markers. One says weak, one says important. This one has three ribbon markers and they look like they're gray, white, and black. And there's a reason this one needs three and you'll see as we go along. This comes, this is $26.95 for a year's planner, and it comes in this ocean blue, they call it, with a gold accent. It comes in a black with on black, so the embossing is just black. It comes in a brown where the embossing is the brown, and it comes in a white with a rose gold, it looks like, embossing on it. This one comes, I think, also in four different colors. It is a quarterly planner, and it is $24.95 for the black, and then there's orange, blue, and purple. And I noticed that the purple is $25.95. So the different colors are different prices on this one. Okay, so let's open them up and kind of look at the differences. This one talks, it says here's their website and they're all across social media and it has a little introduction to the planner. Then it has where you sign a commitment to yourself to fulfill your goals, dreams, accomplish what you set out to do for the year and you sign it. It has a calendar 2018 to 2021. They are both undated. It has your important date section and there's room for six different spots there. And then it goes in depth on how to use this. Set up your yearly goals, your why, your yearly goals, your monthly goals, uh, notes and ideas, reviewing throughout the thing, little icons to remind you to do certain things, inspirational reading, um, and there's some cutout papers that you can pin around the house. And here's your why, setting your SMART goals. It really goes in depth, and then here's your monthly. Okay, so this one has Panda Planner, mypandaplanner.com, and it says if you follow their video training series, you can 10 times your productivity. So, and then it has how to use the planner. And then it goes straight into the monthly. It doesn't have your yearly um, pages or anything like that for you to look at. Okay, so here is the difference between the two. This one has, um, it is slightly bigger, I will say. Um, let me see, put this together here. Just a little bit, it's just a little bit bigger. They're pretty comparable in size. Okay, so here's your monthly. So this one has your SMART goals, three for the month, ideas and thoughts, books to read, lectures to watch. Then it has your routine, when to wake up, when to go to bed, fitness, relaxation, and then two other sections. Take your time and plan your days in detail so that you will be dedicated and achieve your next win. And then of course this is um, undated. And then there are always little um, reminders and little quotes all over the place in this one. And they're different, they vary. So this you fill out your month, your focus for the month, the habit that you wanna work on for the month. There are little H's for you to check off, color in, however you want to mark them. Then there's a little notes section here then plan, this month's goals, distractions to avoid, review, this month's wins, insights gained. I will say, this seems like you have more room to write, and I'm not really sure why that is. I mean, it is a little bit bigger, but I like this ideas and thoughts over this notes section. I, for me, I write too large for this notes section to be any good to me at all. But, I mean, that it, for some people that would be plenty. Just for me, it wouldn't. Um, I also like the books to read and everything like that, but I like this planning and reviewing section here. So they both have good things about them. Now this goes into your weekly, which is each day. You'd circle the day of the week it is, you have your reminder icons for your routine, and then a place for eight different things, tasks, appointments, whatever you need to do for that day. Then it has last week, so this week in review, and next week's goals and focus, okay? Now this goes, and it has six months. This is a quarterly planner, but there are six months, but only 13 weeks. So, 
Okay, so you've got your month. So this is why you've got the three ribbons. So what you would need to do is mark whatever, whatever month you're on, you put the ribbon there. Then you have your weekly. And this is what your weekly looks like. So your day and time, your big wins for last week, how you're gonna improve this coming week, things you will do to make this week great, personal work, family, friends, relationships, I'm looking forward to, habits I'm focusing on developing, learn something new, passion project, and then it's got four projects here, and top goals for the week, okay? So this has, your week is like this, and then it has your review. This is your week here, then you will go forward to your days. So there are 13 weeks, and then you're going to have some days on two pages. And again, you'd need to mark your month, your week, so you can move forward. And it's a day on two pages. So in the morning, it's I'm grateful for, I'm excited about, affirmation, focus, exercise, today's priorities, um, schedule, tasks, notes, today's wins, how I'll improve, okay? So this one each week with the dailies like this look the same. And then when you get to the end of the month, it has um, major accomplishments for the month, challenges for the month, things I can do better, who I am grateful to, reward yourself for your wins in the last month, you deserve it, and a little note section. And then it always at the end of each month, it has a different sort of productivity, time management kind of thing. So this one's your time is limited. There's one about waking up early, persistence. It's just different each month, okay? So this one has um, a lot of reviews. There's a, uh, there's a weekly review, there's a monthly review. This one has your monthly, and then at the end of every month, of course, it has the review. And so then these are all your dailies, and then when it gets to the end of the dailies, you have a few note pages <clears throat> and a gusseted pocket. Okay, so this one has your monthly, your weekly, your daily and all of your information on how this works and being more productive is on their website for you to go watch some videos and learn about and then this little section right here. It is missing to me, is missing sort of a yearly uh, calendar you can look back and forth. But some people don't need that. Some people, it's on your phone, whatever. <laughs> and also you'll be flipping back and forth all the time. If that doesn't bother you, then I think it's a good planner for you. Okay, so this one, when you get to the end of your year, it has a section where you're gonna summarize how your year went. Did I hit my goals? Did I grow? What did I learn? To whom am I, great, whom am I grateful? Summary of my year, personal achievements and wins, things to do better next year, wishes to myself for the next year, and then it's got these notes and ideas pages. And then it's got these sheets that I talked about where you write things down that you might, that you wanna have in your face to remind you all the time, cut them out and post them Put them on your bathroom mirror, put them beside your bed, put them on the refrigerator if, if eating clean or eating better is your goal. You have to see that every time you open the refrigerator. And I think there's 15 of these if I remember right. And then, oh, there's my neighbors doing fireworks. I don't know why. It's two days after Christmas and we're doing fireworks. Okay, so you've got a reference section and then you've got a which includes some books that inspired them. And I haven't read all these books, so I might add these some of these to my list. And then a little thank you, and then a couple pages and a gusseted pocket. So you can see that these both would go a long way to making your year, or for this one, your quarter. So this one, you'd have to buy four of these to get through the year. This one is your year all in one. I am going to be working this one into my planner system for 2020. It will not be my only planner. I do the GTD system and I'm gonna show you in an in a upcoming video how I will work this into my planner system. This is gonna be one that stays in my bag with me. This one I will say, if you're someone who wants to write affirmations every morning and um, as part of their productivity system, this would be a really good one for you. They're both great planners. They're both very different. This in the long run will cost you some more money if you're going to use for a whole year than this one will. Um, I think that's basically the difference is the money and the layout. The layout is very different, but they're both into being very productive, productivity for the year. And I think they're both really great planners. 
So it really just depends on which you prefer. And I will put in the links below to how you can get each of these. Um, there is a coupon code for 10% off for the Panda Planner, Panda Fam. It says you can use this. Now, I don't know if you can use that on Amazon. Oh yeah, it says on Amazon you can use that. And then this one has a code also for a discount. Let me see, let me get to that page. I know I saw it. I wanna win, I-W-A-N-N-A-W-I-N is the coupon code for this one. I'm not sure how much you get off. So there's a coupon code for each of these and I will link to them below how you can get them. Thanks so much for watching everybody and happy planning.